If you're looking to go ice fishing in the northeast part of the state, fishery supervisor Randy Hiltner will go over fish populations, ice conditions, and access. I'm Mike Anderson with the North Dakota Game and Fish Department. Randy, how are things shaping up right now as things can change overnight in the Northeast as far as ice fishing? Uh, good, we've put down pretty good ice so far and, okay. uh, and we've had some ice fishing activity up there already. Randy, people wanna know, I mean, if you go ice fishing, you wanna know fish populations, let's start out with walleyes in the Northeast first. As has been the case the last several years, the same lakes are pretty good uh, as far as walleye populations. Uh, like a Lake Addy, a Lake Coe, and one of the better walleye lakes in the Northeast District has been Dry Lake the last several years. Um, going down towards the Southwest, uh, Herdsfield Tuffy Lake's got a good walleye population, and Goose Lake as well. Okay, let's move into our state fish, the Northern Pike. Still good. Uh, Turtle Mountains have some good lakes. Uh, Carpenter Lake and Lake Upsilon's very good. Bisbee Dam, which had a winter kill last year, but the winter kill didn't affect the northern, so there seems to be lots of nice-sized northerns over there. Uh, Red Willow Lake's another good northern pike lake. Randy, how about panfish? Let's start with perch. Uh, lots of my lakes and reservoirs have perch in, in good numbers. Uh, some of the better-sized perch, though, like a South Golden Lake's got nice-sized perch. Uh, Hami Dam has a fair number of perch at our keeper size as well. Okay, any other panfish? Yeah, some bluegill lakes. Gravel Lake is a newer bluegill lake along with Lake Upsilon and the Turtle Mountains. Uh, we also have this English Cooley Pond over by Grand Forks that has lots of seven, eight inch uh, bluegills. Good for the kids. Randy, any other fish species up in the Northeast? Well, one lake I'd like to mention for rainbow trout is Hooker Lake in the Turtle Mountains. It can winter kill, but it hasn't in several years, so we have some nice big rainbow trout up there that uh, would be great to chase for the anglers. Um, and also in black crappie, uh, Hami Dam has quite a few black crappie. Uh, Fordville Dam has some nice crappie, as does Whitman Dam. Randy, as long as the weather allows and access is available, fish population should be there for ice anglers. Yeah, yeah, there's uh, good panfish and predator species fishing opportunities out there. Uh, last winter we had pretty tough access. There was a lot of track vehicles only uh, fishing going on. Hopefully this winter we don't get quite as deep as snow on the ice pack. A lot of great information, Randy, thank you.